What's up everyone? Today I want to share with you a process that stumped me for a very long time and that is how to access and retrieve your ERC20 tokens that you might have gotten from an ICO for example. And so just rewinding to the beginning, um, let's say you're trying to participate in ICO, you have to sign up on their website and then you get to a page where they ask you to send Ethereum, for example, to their wallet address. And if they're any good, they'll probably tell you not to send Ethereum from your exchange. And instead to choose it from a wallet where you control the private key. And that's because the exchanges don't work well with smart contracts. And so you need something like my Ether wallet, Parity, and there's other choices too. Um, but today I'm going to show you Parity. This one I like a lot. It works straight within your web browser and pretty simple to use. So you get started by going to accounts, create a new account, follow the steps. It's pretty simple. Once that's done, you have a, an account and you send Ethereum from your exchange, for example, here and then from here to the smart contract address. Um, that the ICO provides you. And so once that's done, um, you just wait pretty much until the crowd sale is over and they announce that token withdrawals are um, available now. And so this is where it gets a little bit tricky. You go to settings, make sure that contracts is clicked or else you won't be able to see this. Go to contract, go to watch, token, and then it asks you for the network address for the contract. And so sometimes the ICO provides it to you um, if they're competent, but there's also another way to find this information. And that is going to this e etherscan.io. Um, it's your trusty Ethereum block explorer. But they also have a really cool feature where you can view tokens. And so over here, you can just search for it, either the acronym or the name. Let's just do status, for example, status network SNT. Go to their page. It gives you a bunch of information, but the relevant one is here, contract address. Copy paste this, put it back here, give it a name, click this and click add contract. And so you can click on the contract click balance of, click your own wallet, and click query. This will show you uh, an, an amount if it, everything's good and well. And so after that, if you have an amount, you'll know that you um, have access and control of those new ICO tokens. But then you might be wondering, how do you send this to an exchange in order to um, trade it. That's pretty simple too. You go to execute, click on the functions, go to transfer from, from address is your address, to address is the address that um, corresponds to your wallet for this new token on an exchange that supports this token. So you have to sign up for an exchange that supports this new token, get a wallet for this token, Put the address here, and then you can specify the amount that you want to send. Click Post Transaction. So that was pretty much it. Um, pretty straightforward, but a little bit hard to find out when I was first getting started. I hope this helped. If you have any questions, um, feel free to leave me a comment below. And also, I'd really appreciate it if you click like on this video and subscribe to my channel too. I'll see you on the next one. Peace out.